Hello guys and girls and welcome to this nasty piece of work. Welcome back to Subnautica. So the last episode we built this so-called base that looks like a hashtag. It's nothing fancy but it gets the job done. Off camera I managed to make a few more foundations around it as you can see. And by doing that I increased the whole strength and made it more convenient to add future rooms and corridors. Speaking of which, some of you hinted that there are two islands on the map. And one of them contains a multi-purpose room which I can scan and will be able to build my bioreactor and other cool stuff that are too big. Oh my god. Hey! Goddamn fish! Why aren't you running? You better run. Alright, let's get in. Now, before we go and search for that island, I think it's time we make this mobile vehicle bay that we researched in the last episode and make our first vehicle, Seamoth. We don't have any else, so it's gonna be Seamoth. Someone actually told me that there is a vehicle so big that it's like a mobile base. I wish I had that, man. But guess what? The Seamoth will do too. Alright, deployables, beacon, mobile vehicle bay. We need titanium ingot, lubricant and power cell. I don't know, I think I can make a power cell from these batteries. It's four batteries, I think I need two of them. There we go, power cell. Now, can we make the... Oh, shit, I need titanium ingot. Okay. How much titanium do I need? I guess a lot. I think, like, ten. Titanium freaking ingot. Uh, creature decoy. Nope, we need this mobile vehicle bay. Come on, man, I can't wait to drive my sea moth. Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention. I even played some of these fluorescent lights. What the hell? What? Oh, I guess I don't have enough power. Anyway, mobile vehicle bay. Let's put it right here. There we go. Oh, where is it going? Hey, wait for me. All right, mobile vehicle bay. How do we use you? Use vehicles. Oh, there we go. Seamoth, one person vehicle. Okay, so I need titanium ingot, power cell, glass. Oh my God, I'll be right back. All right, I'm back with all the things I need for the Seamoth. The Seamoth is a fast, safe mode of transport, but remember that swimming is good for your glutes and endorphin levels. <laughs> of course it is. Oh, there we go. Seamoth just fell, fell into the sea. Oh, look at this beauty, man. It's so nice. Um, I just get in there, I guess. What is this? Power cell. Oh, I put the battery in here, I guess. Enter Seamoth. All right, let's enter. Welcome aboard, Captain. Oh, yes, I'm a captain again. Uh, why is the Aurora like that? It's weird. Never mind, let's go on a test drive. Dolphin jump. Yes. Oh, <laughs> that air, though. Dude, I love this thing so much. Look at it, it's so fast and agile. 360 no scope. <laughs> the only problem I have with it is that engine sound in the background. It's so annoying. I mean, I will probably get used to it in the future, but right now I can't stop noticing it. How convenient, look at that. What is this switch for? I have no idea. Anyway, so, where is this damn island? I guess the islands are in those mists right there. Can you see the mist? It's all around and there's that mountain peak right there. And I think I can see another mist somewhere around there. You can see some kind of a clouds or something. Hmm, on which one should we go first? You know what, let's go to this one first. It kind of looks closer to us. Yes, look at that. <laughs> it's a mountain. Jesus, oh no, 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 don't you dare hit, hit it. Okay, fishes, great now. How can I go on this island? Oh, the coast looks like it's here. Yep, it's right here. What the hell is that? Um, are those habitats? I don't think so. What the hell am I doing? Ah, oh, it's so beautiful. But why is it night? I didn't bring my flashlight. God damn it. Can I use this sea glide? Yes, I can. Whoa, what the hell is that? What is that? Is that a crab or something? Hello, oh shit, uh, hello, oh shit, it's hostile, get away from me, fuck you. <laughs> God damn it, this, this island is so beautiful, it's full of life, look at that. Some cute ass trees, what is this? Bulbo tree, <laughs> sounds like Bulbo baggings. <laughs> Bilbo, Bulbo, it's all the same thing. 
Oh, shit, look at that scenery. So good. What the hell? God damn it, these damn, damn crabs. Hey, come here. God damn crab. Where are you? Show yourself. Oh, there you are. I hope you can see, guys. It's, it's so dark in here. Come here. I want to kill your ass. Yes, die. <laughs> You're not going to attack me now, are you, bitch? Screw you. All right, back to our quest. What kind of door is this? Some kind of a force field. What? Insert tablet. I don't have any tablets. What the shit? Is this game screwing with me? Can we go through this force field? No, I can't. I'm trying to go, but it's not letting me. I guess this is some kind of a door, and I need this tablet so I can get into that door. Great, let's go around and explore some more. Maybe we'll find it. Oh, something is, he oh, purple tablet. <laughs> I was right, it's right here. Hello, tablet, that is a huge ass tablet. Can we go into this thing? I don't know, this island is huge. I can't wait to explore it all. There you go. Oh, it's turning off. And it turned off. Great. Scans indicate this structure is composed of a metal alloy with unprecedented integrity. No match is found in database. Performing structural analysis. A background message is being broadcast throughout this facility. Partial translation available. Message reads. Warning, unidentified craft in orbit of this planet will be destroyed. Prevent. This is so creepy, man. What is this? And there's some kind of music started. I love this thing already. Hello, aliens. Are there any aliens around? I wonder. I guess not. This is their so-called base that they left. And what is this? Data terminal. Unknown language. Attempting translation. Hmm? What? What is happening? Did I did I trend? Oh, I got a new PDA. Alien data. Alien data terminal. This terminal was discovered within the alien facility on surface planet. And that using okay. Further alien data required. So I need to do some digging around here, I guess. What the hell is that? Ion cube. Okay. Hello. How are you doing? What is this? I got some kind of item. High capacity alien energy source. Source. <laughs> source. Sauce. <laughs> okay. Do I need this for something? I guess so. It's alien after all. Oh, damn. This is so creepy. Dude, I got more than I bargained for. All I wanted is some habitat blueprints and nothing else. Instead, I got this huge-ass alien structure. <sighs> All right, there's another data terminal right here. Unknown language again. Your best probability of interfacing with this facility is achieved by accessing the control room in the lower section. Okay, and what the hell is this? Oh, shit. Hello. Oh, don't kill me, please. Oh, oh it's some kind of a elevator. <laughs> Great. <laughs> this too could be really handy in real life. Okay, insert tablet. What is this tab? I don't have this tablet. God damn it. Ugh. All of this journey for nothing. And I kissed a damn force field. Ugh. All right, let's go back. Okay, there's some kind of a path in here on the other side of the island. And these torches are leading me to somewhere. Some more crabs. Of course, these goddamn torches. <laughs> of course, come here. There's another one. Jump, jump, please, please jump. Come on, dude. Don't, don't run away. Yes, jump. Fuck you. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. I'm inside of a cave. Okay, there's some more of these damn creatures. Oh, hello, hello. All right. Where are we going? Oh shit! More and more of them. <gasps> what is this? Is this some kind of a? Passage? Insert Ion Cube. I have Ion Cube. I got two of them. Alright, let's insert it. What the hell is happening? No! <laughs> what? What happened? My, my arm was broken. Holy shit, okay. This sea glider is so bugged. I mean, it's making me buggy as hell. 
What the hell is this? Is this some kind of a portal or something? Hello? Oh. Hi. Where am I going? Touch it. Yes, of course. Oh. We are teleporting. Nice effect. A really nice effect. Okay. Where are we now? Where the, guys, where the hell did you lead me? What is this? All I wanted is some damn blueprints. Jesus Christ. All right, let's explore this too. Okay, whoa. What the, where the hell am I? I got so many questions. All right, jump, jump. This water is so beautiful. Seamoth is two kilometers away. Jesus Christ, where did I teleport? <laughs> I'm so far away. <laughs> Where the hell am I? I'm on some kind of a deserted island. I have no food, no water. What is this? Can I eat this? Alien flora sample. No, I can't. What is this? Mink plant. Can I mine this? Nope, I just get some seeds. Jesus Christ. Can I eat those plants? Those bulba plants. Bulbo. Bulbo Baggins plants. Alright. Can I eat those? Yes, I can. Thank you, thank you. I'm gonna eat all of these trees on this island. What is that? That looks like some kind of a habitat or something. Maybe that's our multi-purpose room. Wait a second, am I on the same island? My sea moth is right there, you see that? And we were on that island, I mean, we got on that coast on that island with our sea moth. Now we are here. I think this is the second island you guys were talking about. And seeing that habitat right there, I think we are on the right track. So we teleported on this island. That is great. I just have to eat some of these bulbo trees. Well, I'll be damned. This is a habitat. But why would somebody live on a mountain peak? Look at this. Not me, that's for sure. But we still have to go and search that damn habitat. Multi-purpose room, I mean. Okay, hello. Anybody alive? Oh my god, everything is so rusted. Open supply crate. What is this? Disinfected water. Abandoned PDA. Okay, let's see what we got. Bart Torgal's log number three. Return from the deep. This is the first time I've seen sunlight in months. I've been dreaming of it, but it's hard to enjoy alone. The time we spent on this island when we first crashed, it seems so long ago now. Father was right. We never should have left. We shouldn't have gone so deep. They don't want us down there. Despite my best efforts, the infection is progressing and the visions are getting worse. Margaret and the father are already part of the ecosystem of this incredible planet. It soothes me to know I'll be joining them soon. Okay, this is so disturbing. <laughs> so I guess some kind of a family lived here and they became part of the ecosystem. They died. Some kind of an infection got them. Maybe they became these lantern fruits. Lantern fruits. <laughs> this is so awesome. Lantern fruit. Food. H2O. Oh, it's edible. Now oh, thank you, Bart, for giving me this damn good meal. So, I guess I need to scan this thing. Oh, observatory. This isn't multi-purpose room. I guess I'll be needing this observatory too. I'm not sure. It takes so long to scan it. There we go. Observatory. Bulkhead. Wait a second. This isn't what I came here for, but great. I got another kind of a corridor or something. I'm getting these blueprints I haven't even thought I would get. Wait a second. There's another habitat right there beneath that one. I haven't even seen this one. Maybe, maybe this one has some, some other kinds of wall planter. What? Okay, thank you. Oh my god, these goddamn crabs. Die, you damn crabs. Oh, there we go. Multi-purpose room. Yes. <laughs> this is what I came here for. No. Scan that shit. I need it. I need it full. Yes. I'm so pumped. I got my multi-purpose room at last. Paul Torgal's log number one. Marooned. Chief's log. Holy crap, this chief's log is huge. You know what? I would love to sit and read through all of this, but I don't think a lot of you guys would like to listen to me read some Dead Man's Diary half of the episode. So we're just gonna continue with the story. And there's some kind of a 
There is a PDA right there, but I can't seem to get it. Ugh, this damn rock. Where's the Hulk when you need one? Oh, wow. <laughs> There's a broken window right here. <laughs> I could get into this room all this time. All right, abandon PDA. Degasi's voice log, Storm. Oh, another tablet. All right, here it is, the last habitat. Hello, anybody dead in here? Chinese potato, yes. <laughs> Some more food. There we go. Small, ma what? Is that watermelon or marble melon? <laughs> Great. <laughs> what? I haven't even got into the damn portal. Here we are. Fall damage is a bitch. I just have to take my first aid kit. There we go. But you know what else is a bitch? A tablet. This one in particular. <laughs> yes. Here we go. Open sesame. Yes. Where the hell are we again? <laughs> Me and my questions. Okay, this is a huge pool. And it leads to somewhere probably out. But there's some kind of a door right here. Let's see where it leads. Hello? Oh my god, more stairs. Scans indicate the facility's control room lies beyond this doorway. Okay, why did you stop? <laughs> that was weird. Insert tablet. Yes. Here you go. Eat it. Eat it. Force wheel control. Okay, this is the last room, I guess. The control room. And there's some kind of a computer beam something. Let's see what it is. Oh, this is creepy. Hello. Oh. Disable facility. Okay. Hello. Oh. Wait, hey, what the hell? Hey, get away from me. Don't touch me. Oh, shit. Okay. What happened? The control panel is broadcasting a message. Translation reads, warning, infected individuals may not disable the weapon. This planet is under quarantine. Scans of available alien data indicate the presence of a second facility elsewhere on the planet. Evidence suggests it is located 800 meters below sea level, approximately one kilometer southwest of this installation. Information recorded to data bank. What did I just get myself into? Uh, guys, you haven't told me how to get a main quest right here. It's so weird, but I, thank you, I guess. Now I know my path at least. So the only thing left for us to do is to find out where this how exit leads. And it leads us somewhere. What the hell is that? What the hell is that? Hello. Are you friendly? Hello? What the hell? What is that? What the shit? What? What the fuck? Get away. Get up. Fuck you, dude. Oh my god. God, that little bastard, fuck off. Shoo, shoo, <laughs> get away. Wow, what was that? Dude, wow, it's so cool, holy shit. Let's get our Seamoth and screw away from this island. <sighs> Back at home, gotta love this smell. This is Avery Quinn of Trading Ship Sunbeam Aurora. Do you read? Over. Yep, I do. Still nothing. These Altera ships. They've run out of engine grease. They send an SOS. You offer to help? They didn't pick up. Aurora, I'm out on the far side of the system. It's gonna take more than a week to reach your position. Do you still need our assistance? Over. I'll try them again tomorrow. See what the long-range scan picks up in the meantime? Damn Charter's gonna have us wasting our profit margin running errands for Altera. I guess I'm getting saved. That is awesome. But that also sounds too good to be true. Alright, after some time gathering stuff, I did manage to find materials for multi-purpose room and scanner room. So this will be interesting. Multi-purpose room. Where should we put it? Let's put it right here oh it shows where it's connected great all it needs some titanium but it's building so slow 
it may be prudent to separate work and leisure spaces to maximize productivity. Treat this space as your home, but never forget that it is not. Hmm, wise words, wise words. So, multi-purpose room, it's right there. Let's go and get into it. Yes, ah, look at that room, it's huge. Now the question is, can we put our stuff in it? Where is it, where is it? Bioreactor, yes, we can, great. Yes, lithium, lubricant, no, wait. I need titanium and <laughs> lubricant. Why did I say lithium? A reliable power source is a critical step towards self-sufficiency. Consider keeping a photo journal of your achievements to motivate you in times of despair. Okay, thank you for your concern AI, but I think that making a gameplay recording is even better than doing a screenshot. Ah, uh, look at this beauty, bioreactor. It's finally ours, but it's inactive. How do we use it? Oh, I need to put some stuff in it. Probably some kind of biomaterial. Of course, I'm gonna put my favorite type of biomass, acid mushrooms. I love these purple funguses. Mm -mm, would you look at that? It's mixing them so good. What the hell is happening? What? What is this? Hello? What are you? What am I? I don't know what am I. I'm a human, I guess. My goodness, this is so weird. I got goosebumps. I guess I woke something up when I was going around and exploring those islands. Oh, man. All right, next up, scanner room. Holy crap, this thing is so huge. Okay, where should we put it? I think my light here is making some problems. Get away, damn light. Floodlight. Scanner room. Can we put it now? No? Nope. Oh, damn it. I took away my floodlight for no reason. There we go. A scanner room. But how the hell do we get in there? <laughs> it's not even connected. Okay, I think I saw a vertical connector right here. Nope. It's not working, of course. I don't know why, but this is the only way we can make it. <laughs> it's so unesthetic. But guess what? Now we have a scanner room at least. There we go. Scanner room. Okay, so this is the map. Fabricator. Another one? Oh, it's a fabricator for camera drone, scanner room, and upgrades. Great. What is this? Control camera. Whoa, hello. Look at that. I'm using a camera. Damn, dude. This is so good. <laughs> Can I take a look at myself? No? So at the moment, my map looks very small. I mean, look at those polygons, man. <laughs> but you know what? There's the ridge, there's our base. It's accurate, that's what matters. Since there are scanner room upgrades right here, that's probably not the end of it. Maybe we will get some larger map or more detailed map or something. I don't really know, but I'm still happy we got one. Scanner room, check. Multi-purpose room, check. Bioreactor, check. You know what's not checking? This aquarium. <laughs> That's right. We need to put one right here. Yes. Come on, baby. Give me those damn fishes. I want to have pets. Okay. Aquarium, but no pets. Maybe I can put some fishes in it. I'll be right back. <laughs> I totally feel like Ash catch them right now. Gotta catch them all. All right, aquarium. See all those fishes I got? Here, take them. I don't need them. You surely do. Whoa, look at that. Hello, my babies. How you doing? <laughs> They're so cute, enjoying life. But there is one thing. Why are all of them miniature version of themselves? They were much bigger when I got them. Anyway, this is it for this episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, I would appreciate if you leave a like. Consider subscribing to the channel, and if you want to support the channel even further, the Patreon link is in the description. That is all from me, I'll see you in the next video, peace out.